All right, what you're seeing is the towel that's soaking up the catnip tea that Con got so excited about that he spilled all over the floor. But now the tea-soaked towel is the most interesting part. Is it snuffy? We did have a cute disaster that caused it. Yes. Khan was loving, uh, he was taking sniffs of the tea and um, was rubbing his face around the sides of the bowl and kept rubbing it so hard. I said, I think he's going to knock that over. And before I could get up, it was it all over the floor. So. I put the rest of it in the baking dish over there that Snuffy seems to be thinking about. Con is just in love with this towel now. You get it all over your body. So to do this, you just put about two teaspoons of catnip in a um, coffee mug of water and strain it out or you could put it inside a coffee filter filter and tie it shut con be nice to her she'll share yeah she's gonna share so you put your don't use a twist tie though to close your um, coffee filter if you're going to put your catnip inside a coffee filter don't use a twist tie to shut it because it has metal in it but um, close it by some other safe manner and shove it in the microwave or just pour hot water over it and I guess you can use it you know you people know how to make tea what am I talking about make tea with catnip they love it right Con don't put sugar in it though no don't put sugar in it cats don't need sugar they sweet enough already use some more Snuffy, you being sweet? Mm. Yes, Con. That's good tell. <clears throat> All right. Y'all have a happy Catter Day this weekend. Always Catter Day here. <laughs>